for that myself. Um, but you know what? I don't play. I don't play much competitively, so I don't know. You, I, I expect to see a lot of Nato. He does a lot of good. A lot of good nares. Really uses spacing well to, to try and keep Sheik out. I, he, I, don't, I don't think he does projectile game as much as uh, as much as other ZSS do play. Right. Yeah. Most uh, Zero Suit Samus. Uh Play the blaster a lot. Yeah, and, you know he, he is he's using it a bit, and he's utilizing his tilts as well. Anytime she's jumping in, and uh, I don't know, it's just a spacing issue. I, I find even even playing even playing Sheik is just so easy to get in on somebody. And right. ZSS is one of the ones because she has a lot to a lot to keep you out. Like her side B, her down B, her just her her uh, phaser, everything about it. And I always get caught. I always get caught by her down B. I don't know. I don't know why. Yeah, I always get tricky. caught charging ne needles yeah. on the side every single time, because it comes in. It comes in a lot quicker than I'm expecting it to. And yet, that lateral range makes it so. I, I find this matchup really difficult because of the fact that you have Sheik, not having that high kill potential, and right. you have ZSS able to get back on from basically any part of the map. Like right. her lateral movement is amazing. Her vertical movement is amazing. Yeah, yeah. Zero has a lot of kill potential. Uh, exactly. Yeah. But uh, you see with Sparky, even Sparky's trying to trying to space a bit, which is funny. He's using a lot of needles to rack up that damage and trying to get some, uh, hopefully a floppy fish. Oh, looking for a spike there. If he would have got that spike, that would have been hype. But I think Sporky just needs to work on uh, winning the neutral for this matchup. You know, I mean. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, and you see, he's he's going for quite a bit of needles, trying to rack up that damage and hope hope that he can get get off either a floppy fish or an, uh, an up air or sorry, uh, up smash. Both but are at uh, kill percents right now. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if that's, that's kill percent for for ZSS, especially for uh, for Sheik. Like that, if if she, if he was la landing that, if you're near an edge or something, it, it would have. If it would have had the up B on that. Right for up B or up air. Uh, mean, yeah, you're you're basically set. But anything else, like. Right. Like I I, I really like her fares and stuff like that, but it's it's still hard. It just racks up damage. It's, the kill potential on it is really low. You have to basically juggle them out of the map yeah. before it even gets anywhere. Since Zero Suit's such a fast character, you know, it's hard to get, uh, you know. It is true. I, I find it really, uh, especially at these these percentages as well, you're knocking the knockback on all your moves is so high that it, it's hard to combo them after a while. Yeah. I'm going to expect to see some sort of uh, some sort of risky play from, from Venato. No big deal. He goes, he goes for it all the time. And see, that's going to be a kill right there. And that's, I right. get caught. That's exactly right. who I get caught with every single time, especially yeah. against these. It comes out of nowhere. Like, it does, because you don't expect it. And you try to you try to shield out of it, or you try to stop your needles, and it just doesn't work quick enough. I think he's going to really, uh, I think Spork is really going to be aiming for a floppy fish kill at this point. He's trying to, get, he's trying to keep neutral game. He should go for some, uh, some side tilts to rack up some damage on him. I think he might go for the uh, up throw, then teleport. I've seen him do that quite a lot. Yeah, yeah. You know what? You could do that. I'm really bad at it, so I, I, I don't even attempt it anymore. Just got to read the air dodge. Yeah. And I think it, Spork, is, Spork is a little bit late on his... Uh, well, he did it there. Like, it was the dash attacks. He's actually not as been getting a lot of the dash attacks and, and uh, it's just miss miss moves for for no reason. Oh, and if he could have if he could have followed that up with a with an up B, that right. could've have been a kill. Yeah, Zero Suit is scary. Yeah, he is. Or she is, yeah. And even that right there, I've had a I've had something happen where um, see like well like we were talking about earlier, you had the whole Oh what the, I don't know what happened there. It's like an S D. Yeah. But it just like that, you saw how much knockback that had, and it's just really hard for any combos to actually happen for uh, for Sheik. And she has good, she's good air movement. Like she seems, she she's a she's not a super heavy character, but she does have a lot of mobility area, like aerial mobility. Oh, definitely. Yeah. That's one thing I noticed when I tried her. I mean, like, uh, yeah, felt like playing on ten sensitivity and like an FPS. Like, yeah. So uh, yeah, you know, it's almost you have to be. it's kind of like the same thing as like when you do your Falcon up B and then you're you're going back and forth. I right. find it so difficult to grab ledge if, I, if I'm trying to dodge something. Yeah. I always end up just yeah. SDing every single time. Just like uh, Sporky's closing the gap here. Uh, He's, yeah, he's bringing up that percent, which is which is great. This Good is all he needs back. to do. But he, you saw how long it took him to get that first kill, and that oh. first kill was mostly an SD. It wasn't wasn't no, by any other it's means. But obviously, it's nothing like that is going to kill ZSS. Surprised to go for a side throw there, trying to get him off and trying to get a spike instead. Yeah, things are getting risky. Okay. Yeah, this is yeah he's going for some risky moves there because 
by charging that. He could have he could have rolled up instead. Sporky playing it relatively safe though. And that's gonna be ooh nice DI. Yeah, nice DIs for days. I, I'm always scared about that the ZSS up tilt. Sporky with the dash attack. You're risky with the dash attack at this point too, because yeah. if you can get a grab off, that's extremely risky. But no, he's maintaining the neutral ground here, and he's he's winning it. But it's whether he can get that kill off. Going oh. either way at this point. Wow, up tilt's going. Or a side tilt. That's, that's insane. Same thing. That would be a shitty loss if you're losing on a, <laughs> on a side tilt. It's basically some death at this point. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that could be it. Probably should have went for a, a forward throw on that one rather than another one. Just a matter of who makes the first mistake. Yeah. Most just want to watch at this point. Jesus. I do think ZSS has a slight advantage in this one, and that's where we're gonna there see it, is. it right there. there. Is. That was a that was a tense match, though. Yeah, that was a very close match. Very close. Very match. very close. So you think you're gonna have some uh, some chances here to go to a, uh, kind of an off map instead? So I I don't know if you, right. well, do you want to take over? Well, sure. You want to take over? Why do you not want to? I don't I don't, do I, I don't play competitively. I just I just play. I don't, I don't even own this game, man. You fucking oh yeah, yeah. Well, you do play duck gun, so <laughs> you do really well with them though. Bucks. You going by soup still? Oh, yeah. All right. How many uh, viewers or no? Uh, I doubt very many. Uh, I'm just trying to minimize my uh, stage fright, you know? <laughs> oh, you just got five people on there <laughs> right now. Okay, okay. Don't worry, chat. Don't worry, chat. It's not going to be bad. So if, if they say anything, it'll be right here. But I don't think... Where are they? Oh, it's this. So technically only two. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks for joining us, guys. Meta Knight's changeup for Sporky. You know what? I've heard that he's been switching over to this uh, as of late, and I'm not sh exactly sure why. I, I haven't oh, seen very. Meta Knight is really scary, actually. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Once he gets into those up air strings, like your life is over. <laughs> yeah, he is. It's, yeah. It's, it's it is scary. It is really scary. And I, you know what? I, I don't play against Meta Knight, so I, I think that matchup would just completely screw me up. The stage has a really low ceiling, so it's kind of beneficial for both players uh, yeah. with their uh, up B kill moves, you know? Yeah, for sure. So just, her, just her up air juggles alone, getting them up there. That could be really dangerous. Right. I absolutely hate this map, though. Oh, me too. Me too. I, I, I See, and you know what? He keeps getting caught with that. And it, he's, he's doing it exactly like I, I've always done it. I, I don't anticipate it, it being as quick as it is, and that down B will come out of nowhere. Yeah. Wow. Oh, that almost killed. That did. I did not realize that did so much. And I, I noticed the only move that I ever used when I was playing Meta Knight was a side B. Right. But I, I, it's just so easy to telegraph. He has a really good dash. You'll wow. Nice oh, hit. Nice. That was a nice really read. good up, up smash. One thing I've noticed, you see, it's another one of those again. It's just getting caught in those positions, and you would think he'd try to go off map a little bit more with Meta Knight rather than sitting. Wow, that's insanity! What is that? Was that his down? That's, is that his down B? Uh, neutral B. This is neutral B. Yep. That's incredible. Let's see if Sporky can uh, close his stock. He's, he's at kill percent for sure. Like for zero, two, yeah, yeah. Especially against Meta Knight too, and. What, what what would you expect him to go for? Wow, wow, low ceiling just takes it. That's that's well well played. First game, uh, no big deal. 